Hello students, today we are going to discuss what is Python and what are the different features of Python. Python is a general purpose, dynamic, high level and interpreted programming language. It supports object oriented programming approach to develop application and it is easy to learn and provides lots of high level data structures. That is, this is a high level language. This is an interpreted programming language, not a compiled. It is interpreted programming language and it is, it is a general purpose language and it supports object oriented programming approach and it is very easy to learn. And it, it is used to create application development. Okay. And it is a dynamic typing language. And it is very simple language. And it supports multiple programming pattern. That is object oriented approach it takes. It imperative, uh, imperative approach. And the functional or procedural programming styles also it supports. And Python is not intended to work in a particular area such as web programming. That is, it is known as the multi-purpose programming language. It can be used with web enterprise, 3D CAD, etc. And it is also a language which is dynamically typed. That means, we, that is, we don't need to use data types to declare variable because it is dynamically typed. We can write a equal to 10 to assign an integer value in an integer variable that is dynamically typed. And it makes the development and debugging very fast because there is no compilation step included in Python development. That is, in, that is it is an interpreted language and the edit to test debug cycle is very fast. And the history of the Python, it was invented by Guido van Rossum in 1991 at CWI in Netherlands. The idea of programming language has taken from the ABC programming language or we can say that AB is a predecessor of the Python language. There is also a fact behind choosing name Python that is he say, he was a Guido Van Rossum was a fan of the popular BBC comedy show of that time Monty Python's Flying Circus Monty Python's Flying Circus so he decided to pick the name Python for his newly created programming language why we learn python that is python provides many useful features to the programmer these are the some features, easy to use and learn, expressive language, interpreted language, object oriented language, open source language, it is extensible, learn standard library, GUI programming support that is graphical user interface programming support, integrated, embeddable, dynamic memory allocation, wide range of libraries and frameworks. These are the different essential features of Python. Why Python is used? Python we know it is a general purpose popular programming language and it is used in almost every technical field. The various areas of Python use are data science, data mining, desktop application, console based application, mobile application, software development, artificial intelligence, web application, enterprise application, 3D CAD application, machine learning, computer vision or image processing application, speech recognitions, loads and loads of areas are there where the Python language is used. And the Python features in detail. That is, Python provides many useful features which make it popular and valuable from the other programming language. It supports object-oriented programming, procedural programming approach and provides dynamic memory allocation. First one, easy to learn and use. That is, Python is easy to learn as compared to other programming language. Its syntax is very simple. It is very straightforward and much the same as this English language. There is no use of the semicolon or curly bracket and the indentation defines the code block. It is a recommended programming language for beginners. That is Python is a very simple language to learn. No semicolon, no curly bracket etc. in this Python. Then 
एक्सप्रेसिव लैंग्वेज पाइथन कैन परफॉर्म कॉम्प्लेक्स टास्क यूजिंग ए फ्यू लाइन्स ऑफ कोड ए सिंपल एग्जाम्पल हेलो वर्ल्ड प्रोग्राम यू सिंपली टाइप प्रिंट हेलो वर्ल्ड इट विल टेक ओनली वन लाइन टू एक्सिक्यूट वाइल जावा और सी टेक्स मल्टीपल लाइन इन जावा वी हैव टू गिव दैड ऑफ फायर देन मेन देन वी हैव टू गिव दिस सिस्टम डॉट आउट डॉट प्रिंटर लाइन देन हेलो वर्ल्ड बट इन पाइथन इट टेक्स ओनली वन लाइन प्रिंट हेलो वर्ल्ड इन सी वी हैव टू गिव दैड ऑफ फायर देन मेन देन वी हैव टू गिव प्रिंट ऑफ that is it's an expressive language and it is an interpreted language it means the python program is executed one line at a time okay it makes debugging easy and portable cross platform language python can run equally on different platforms such as windows linux unix and macintosh etc so we can say python is a portable language it enables programmers to develop the software for several competing platforms by writing a program only once we can write a simple program and we can run it in different platform that is cross platform language or we can say it is portable or the portability feature then free and open source python is freely available for everyone it is available on its official website www.python.org it has a large community across the world that is dedicatedly working towards make new python modules and functions anyone can contribute to the python community that is open source means anyone can download its source code without paying any penny open source means it is available in the internet it is free to use it is open source that is anyone can download it its source code without paying any penny that is open source object oriented programming language python is a object oriented programming language that is it supports the object oriented language and concepts of class and objects come into existence that is there are many concepts of object oriented language that is class objects inheritance polymorphism encapsulation all these are the features of the object oriented language then extensible it implies that other languages such as c or c++ can be used to compile the code and thus it can be used further in our python code it converts the program into byte code and in and any platform can use that byte code that is it is an extensible language that means other languages like c or c language or c++ language can be used to compile the code and thus it can be used further in our python code okay so it converts the program into byte code and at any platform this byte code can be used so it is extensible next is large standard library that is it provides a vast range of libraries for the various fields such as machine learning web developer and also for the scripting there are various machine learning libraries such as tensorflow pandas numpy keras and pytorch django flask pyramids are the popular framework for python web development then gui programming support graphical user interface is used for the de for developing desktop application that is these are the libraries which are used for developing the web application these are the libraries which are used for developing the web application then integrated it can be easily integrated with languages like c C++ and Java, etc. Python runs code line by line like C, C++, Java. It makes easy to debug the code. Then embeddable. The code of the other programming language can use in the Python source code. We can use Python source code in another programming language as well. It can embed other language into our code that is embeddable that is code of the other programming language can use in our python code 
we can use this python code in another programming language as well that is known as the embedder it can embed other language into our code then dynamic memory partition that is in python we don't that is dynamic memory partition in python we don't need to specify the data type of the variable when we assign some value to the variable it automatically allocates the memory to the variable at run time suppose we are assigned integer value 15 to x then we don't need to write index equal to 15 just write x equal to 15 that is dynamic memory allocation allocating the memory dynamically so all these are the features of the python that's all for today thank you